Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be giving you guys a tutorial on how to get to the majors and merge to the show the most efficient way. So let's get right into it. Okay guys, so if you didn't know, they did change her to the show this year. They play as a female ball player and there's actually a draft. Now, the draft doesn't really matter that much. You could honestly just skip it. You're, you will get drafted in higher rounds, which is going to play some factor, but you're better off just skipping it, not wasting the time and just getting straight into your double-A career, but you are going to be in double-A no matter what. So, you guys are going to be able to pick your team like usual. I've picked the Royals, so I'm on their double-A team, the Naturals. And the quickest way for you guys to get called up is going to be going into settings, gameplay, and then change your hitting difficulty, pitching difficulty, put both of those on beginner. And that is basically going to make it so you get a fastball down the middle every single time the pitcher throws the ball to you. So you realistically should be hitting a home run or just getting on base every time. You are going to pop out sometimes because you're just not going to have that much power at the start. But that is fine. You guys should most of the time though be getting pretty big swings in the bat. So as you guys can see, I'm on the calendar board. And I'm just going to give you guys a little time roadmap of when you should be getting called up and where. So that, as you can see, the season starts April 5th. That's, my, that's our opening day for this. And you should be call, getting called up to AAA realistically around sometime in July. Maybe after this little break here. You usually do get called up after breaks. And if they kept it the same as last year, which they probably did, you should be getting called up to the majors in late September. But you may need to go into your next season and do a little bit more work before you get to the majors. But even if that does happen, guys, that should not be much of an issue. You should be getting to the majors within two seasons. If you're not, then you are probably doing something wrong. Your game is just kind of like bugging out and you might need to play a little extra season, I guess. One other quick thing I have to say is you cannot sim any games because if you sim the game, it will not really help you your stats at all if you just sim 10 years you're gonna stay in double a you're not gonna get called up or anything that's just kind of gonna be a waste of time for you you are actually gonna have to play every single game if you want to get called up the most efficient way okay so that is basically all i have to say one thing you guys might want to just do you're gonna want to put on your perks do your certain skill set and you're also gonna want to choose your guy to be a power hitter because that'll just make it easier for you to hit home runs and the ball is going to be thrown down the middle every time. So you really want to have the most power that you possibly can. So it'll just be more efficient. If you guys want, you could go out. If you're like super rich, getting all money spent, you could go out on Diamond Dynasty, buy the best cleats and stuff. I recommend just working towards these programs, doing the missions. And yeah, that is basically it for the tutorial if you guys have any questions or other things you need tutorials on for mlb the show or road to the show leave a comment and i'll most likely do it so yeah make sure to like and subscribe if you guys didn't enjoy this tutorial and i'll see you in the next one